Hi everyone! Today's page actually came together really quickly. I was in disbelief because it took me only 8 minutes to do. What really helped me speed up the process for this page was because I actually saved the menu that my friend had at her wedding. These two pictures are actually probably the same pictures and one of them I had brightened up so that you could see us a little better. My girlfriend who got married, she wanted a photo with her classmates from grad school and me and another one of my friends went to her wedding and we all had went to grad school together. So we got this photo of our little group I had some branding strips left over, so I decided to put those underneath the photos to give it a shelf to sit on. And the background sheet of paper I chose is the one with lots of windows because at my girlfriend's wedding, she had it in this beautiful conservatory and had a lot of windows. It was pretty much glass everywhere. So I wanted to remind myself that that is where the room was, so that's why I ended up choosing this pattern paper. Because the pattern paper is so plain, I definitely wanted to bring some more color in and that's where I added the branding strips. One of them actually had a company name on it, but I was able to cover up it with another branding strip, so you can't tell. I didn't stack my photos on top of one another exactly. I actually offset them a little bit from each other. What I really liked was how I was able to use the branding strips and overlap it onto the menu. There were little pockets in the menu where they had some openings and free space, so I was able to just overlap them. I wanted to use one of my die cut pieces, and it said Best Buds, and I didn't really like that sentiment. So to do my own thing, I decided to take another one of the die cuts. It was like a little banner, and I layered it right on top of that die cut and replaced it with RBS, which is the school that we had went to, then the thing would read RBS Buds, which works out a lot more appropriately for our photo. I also wanted to add something to the top, possibly another title. What I really wanted to use was this wonderful gold sticker. I liked how Hello worked, so I thought the title could read Hello Wonderful, and then it could also read Wonderful RBS Buds. I liked these little macaroon cake stand die cuts. I thought they were really cute. And whenever I think of macaroons, I think of sweet. And I do relate thinking of sweet and how sweet it was to have and be there for my girlfriend. Underneath the macaroon die cuts, I decided to add this neon green baker's twine that I had left over from the Rub-Ons packaging. Lastly, to add some more color, I added some enamel dots and I changed up the colors instead of using the same ones in all three locations. I used one yellow, one mint, and one orangey red. I made sure that I had three clusters surrounding photo the photos so that you will focus in on the photos. And I just really liked having the menu on the side. And that's pretty much my page. So. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And don't forget, I have a giveaway going on this week, so head on over to my giveaway video and subscribe and leave me a comment. Have a crafty day, everyone!